Hi, thanks for watching my video. Any of you out there that have seen my channel know that I have created probably three or four videos on how to move assets from one map to another. Well, in one of the comments on one of my latest videos, which I cannot find that comment, I went to my email, I went to, I can't find it, but it said, thanks, but I found an easier way. And that person left a link to another guy's YouTube channel and I clicked on it and it brought me over and, and to whoever left that comment if you see this video leave a comment down in the comments because I like to give you credit so that person in the comments left a link and when I clicked on that link it brought me over to this guy's uh, YouTube channel and his name is Sashka Kleinwacha I guess he's German I'm pretty sure he's German because he's actually drinking beer while he's making his video. That's really cool. But anyways, in this video, he shows the process of a software that he made that allows you to move assets over um, without having to edit the materials folder or files with Notepad++. It does it. The software does everything for you. And I want to go through that process and show you how it's done. So click on, I'll, I'll put a link to this guy's channel and you can just click on this or you can, I'll put the same link in my description. So I clicked on the description. It brings you over to, I guess it's uh, GitHub. And this file structure here is not the exact that he shows in his video. But I scroll down here to download and clicked on this and then it allowed me to get the program that he shows in his video which is this BMMG level cleanup master zip and when I unzipped it it brought me to this and this matches up with the hierarchy file structure on his video so just like in his video, he tells you to launch the exe file. And the software pops up. Pretty straightforward up to this point. <clears throat> so what we're going to use, I don't know about map shrinker, rename map, copy assets, convert asset. The only thing I'm going to be working with is copy assets and rename map. So let's click on copy assets. <clears throat> And I'm not going to get into the details like he did about everything up here. I'm going to assume that everybody understands all that. All I'm going to do is click click on a source and a destination. Source being where I want to get my assets from and destination where I want to move them to. That's it. So let's click a source. And again, we're going to go with, I always use grid map V2 because it's so easy to see when you move it successfully because of all the squares and shapes and stuff. So we'll do grid map V2. And over here, you got a little thing. Just let it, I let everything finish. I don't want to get ahead of the program and confuse anything. Select the zip source file level that you want to copy from, grid map V2, and select the target level that you want to copy to. <clears throat> so we'll move everything over to um, Jungle Rock Island. Actually, let's go, yeah, Jungle Rock Island. So we're moving grid map V2 to Jungle Rock Island. Let everything over here finish. <clears throat> Just so we don't get ahead of the program. You can see it populates here with all the files. Something cool here I want to point out to you. You can arrange these by asset type by clicking on that and it puts all the DAE files together. It tells you a brief description of what they are. And if on the view tab, if you click on the little magnifying glass here, it will actually show you the DAE. This is a Christmas tree light amber, so that would be very, very small. I don't think you're going to be able to see that. Uh, but if we do something like this barrier, and this window will pop up. And you can actually see the shape, the, the, the DAE. And that is really another cool feature. So again, you click on the magnifying glass for view. Asset types to put them into, to link everything together. So the next thing is to 
I'm just going to copy everything. If you wanted to copy just the DAEs, you could go through and select just the DAEs. And that's another cool feature. But in this case, for simplicity, we'll just click everything. Next step is copy assets. And just click copy. And let that finish. It says, please be a patient at the hospital. No, please be patient. Done. Now you go to rename map. <clears throat> current name of the selected level is Jungle Rock Island. So we're going to call this, we'll call it test, test map, which so test map, something unique, test map rock. Don't use any spaces here. Um, use underscores. On the next one down here, you can just write whatever you want. Test map, rock, jungle. Yeah, I guess that'll work. Let me just check everything here. Okay. Now you want to click rename level. Are you sure? Yes. Let it finish. Now the next step is to build a zip file. You can click right here and see the different compression, but I'll just leave it on optimal because that's where it was at. And you click build a zip file and this will actually build a level. That's correct. Now this takes a while. This took, last time I did this, it took quite a while to do this. You can click right here and actually see there's the Jungle Rock Island right there. Now it should be populating another Jungle Rock Island. You can see I did one right, oh, there it is right there. Test map rock deployed. That's it right there. And you can see it's at zero kilobytes. That means it's populating. It's building the zip file. So it's going to take a while for that to finish. So I'm going to pause the video here. And when this populates, I will bring you back. Okay, it's done now. You can see it is now 1632 and jungle rock is 2202. So yeah, it populated quite a bit. So let's go and launch BMMG and see if we can find our new level with all of the assets from Gridmap V2. All right, so here we are in BMMG, free roam. And there is the original Jungle Rock. Ours was called Test, Test Map Rock Jungle right there. Look at that. All right, so here we are in uh, Jungle Rock Island, beautiful level. F11. Let's go to our asset browser. And there's the name that we typed. Test map rock. Open that. Art. Shapes. And look at that. There's grid. And there's all the shapes in grid map B2. That is just too cool. Nothing but respect for the creator that made that, that program miscellaneous. Unbelievable. Job well done. Job well done.